I got one of yours, I'll look kind of the stuff. That was back when you got changed from your dollar for a big exactly. Mac and fry and a coke. Uh, exactly. <laughs> when a dollar was a dollar bill. <laughs> you made a dollar bill. Bill. When they opened them up, <laughs> big Mac, large coke, and a fry, <laughs> got five cents back for your dollar. Yeah. The drinks are still a dollar. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, only in the summer. You know what I think you do? Can I show you something? Can I show you? You go like this. Look. No, but Jenna, look at me. Keep it straight like this. Oh. You need to reload. Reload it again. And then go like this. Like a fan. Woo! See? No, no. Stick your face in it. What are you doing? I can't believe it. I've got love like an ocean, I've got love like an ocean, I've got love like an ocean in my soul. I've got love like an ocean, I've got love like an ocean, I've got love like an ocean in my soul. I've got peace like a river, I've got peace like a river, I've got peace like a river in my soul. See, there's a fountain flowing deep and wide. <laughs> right now, you guys are here for the corners. I think I saw you guys. So we've been in church a couple of times. Um, you guys remember the song Enemies Camp? Yeah. <laughs> I love that song. Very like you get really really yeah, into it. <laughs> So we're gonna do that one, and uh, pretty, it's pretty easy, and there's some actions that go along with it too. So if you wanna do that, <laughs> we'll try that. All right. Well, I went to the enemy's camp, and I, I took back what he stole from me. I took back what he stole from me. I took back what he stole from me. Well, I went to the enemy's camp. And I, I took back what he stole from me. He's under my feet. He's under my feet. He's under my feet. He's under my feet. Satan is under my feet. We love try it again. Well, I went to the enemy's camp. And I, I took back what he stole from me. 
<laughs> the fact that he's already forgiven us is a reflection of that. What, what happens when we don't forgive, though? Well, if we don't forgive, we keep, we keep hold of it, don't we? And we keep record of it. You know, somebody says, I forgive you, and the next week brings up what you did. Did they really forgive you? And so, in order to forgive, it means we don't keep a record. It's as though the person never did it anymore. When we forgive them, we wipe it clean. That's the way God forgives us, right? Jesus says that he takes our sins and he buries them in the deepest part of the sea. As far as the east is from the west, so far has he removed our sins from us. So God expects us to forgive others in the same way. But what happens when we do not forgive? Or what happens when we do not let go of that record? Well, one, it shows that we are indifferent to what God has done for us. God died for us. He came, he died on the cross in order to be able to forgive our sins. But he didn't just say, okay, I canceled the record, but I keep it on my book to bring it out later. God cancels it and he wipes it clean. He'll never, ever bring that sin against us again. Ever. That means ever, ever. 